loves! Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing part two of that massive spring break haul that I just... I don't know, man. I literally have been doing so many gigantic freaking hauls lately that I'm just like, I need to start splitting them up, you know what I mean? Like, I can't keep uploading like 40 minute videos and hoping everyone's on board. So I hope you guys are cool with me just dividing it up. Let me know what you guys like better, whether it's like really long hauls or kind of like shorter ones. Today I'm going to be chatting about some things from Forever 21 and Urban Outfitters. That's the two stores that I shopped at. And if you want to catch my last haul, I will link it down below. That was all like things from Boohoo, some swimwear, some really, really cute cute stuff. You know me, I can talk for 10 hours, so I'm gonna shut up and just get into the haul. Also, this was filmed like yesterday, so I'm sorry I'm like in a different outfit and I look totally different. I wanted to grab some of these little bralettes because I own a few of them already and I've gone through so many. They're really, really nice and comfy and I think that they serve well on days when it's too hot to function. Some people hate it when girls wear like bralettes as crop tops. I think it's like so standard and normal now and do what you want to do and wear what you want to wear, but I wound up grabbing it in white obviously, and this is going to be the one in the try-on, but I also grabbed it in a black color, just a really nice basic little black one because it's opaque, it goes with absolutely everything, and a nude, mostly for like under clothes and things like that, and they will get so much usage. I love bralettes, I hate wearing real bras, um, I love wearing them as tops, and you know, I just think that they're super duper cute. Speaking of which, I wound up grabbing this little Calvin Klein bralette, and I think she is so adorable, I love Calvin Klein, it's in this really pretty rose color and it just has the Calvin Klein band underneath. I have a basic just like um, kind of tanky Calvin Klein bra. I don't know if that makes any sense or even if that was English. And it's not this one because I found this and I was like this is like a really more covered version of what I already own. The one that I own is like a scoop top. Um, this one has a lot more material. It's like a high neck. Really it's a tank top more than anything. So I thought it was really really cute. Um, again has like the Calvin jeans band right there. I love Calvin's. And then I got a pair of just boy shorts because I like them a lot and they're super duper comfy. Um, they have like a lot of stretch. Uh, sometimes plus girls will um, say, or I've, I've worn a Calvin Klein bra before and some girls will say like, wow, I don't know if I could even wear that. Their bras are totally on the small side, like I have small boobs, but like their actual Calvins have so much stretch. So they're really nice and comfy and super duper cute. Actually, now that I'm looking at this, I grabbed this for this haul, um, but I do think I may have grabbed this particular item at PacSun and not at Urban. I'm not sure. Oh no, it has an Urban tag on it. That just solved everything. Wow. I'm leaving that in the video. So it's just this really cute little cropped top. Um, it's like a gray marl design. I thought this would look bomb with just a pair of like high-waisted jeans and um, like heads or something as shoes. I don't even know. I just thought it would look so cool. I'm a sucker for crop tops. I love them so much, especially this time of year. So I grabbed it and I think it's amazing. Um, then I grabbed this Adidas t-shirt and this is a men's like extra large Adidas t-shirt, but it just has the galaxy as the like symbol and I thought it would be nice for everything. I love wearing these when I run errands. I love wearing these to bed. Um, they're the most comfortable, softest things on planet Earth, so I always grab them whenever I see a style that I like. So I got the galaxy. I do actually buy men's clothes a lot from Urban Outfitters and just in general, I love men's clothing. Um, this t-shirt just looked so cool to me and I grabbed it in black too, but it never got here. So I need to actually contact customer service about that. But it is like this bleached out t-shirt with blue um, bleaching and it's like a pink, like a really soft pink. And again, I really love being casual 99% of the time. Like I love feeling comfy and looking cute. So things like this are amazing. I would probably just wear this with a choker and um, just like a pair of jeans or something because I think it's like so cute and fun and different. I grabbed a couple of dresses. I want to grab this in other colors, but I grabbed it in this blue one to see how I liked it first, and I freaking love it. It's like a faded sort of denim-y blue color, um, and it's a really cute little dress. It just has a pocket here and then cinches in at the waist and flares out like so, and I thought it was a nice mix of like girly and still really really casual you know what I mean like it has like that really casual fit to it it's really soft and effortless and it looks like a t-shirt on top and then it has that sort of girly like skatery skirt um detail on bottom so I grabbed that and I'm totally gonna get more shades of that it was also $59 which is a lot but it just feels so good and I know that I'm gonna get a million and ten wears out of it 
This I believe was on clearance, um, and this is from a brand that I'm realizing that I really like. It's called Kimchi Blue, and these were just like these really cool little sweater dresses, but they were on sale, and I decided to grab them in both this really pretty purple color, again pastels, again spring, will just be so nice for this time of year, and still a little bit warm. Like, the material isn't super thick, but you're still covered up, and it's a nice, like, longer dress, you know what I mean? Um, like, it's not like down to my ankles or something, but... I'm dropping it. That's good. So yeah, it just like fits in at the waist, flares out like so. And so I liked it so much. I decided to also grab it in this pink color. And I think that they may have also had it in like black and maybe a blue, but this is more of a peach actually now that I'm looking at it. It's not even so much like a pastel pink as much as it is like a hardcore peach. So I just thought those would be really cute. And again, like more of those soft, like kind of go-to spring pieces. Now that we are through Boohoo and Urban Outfitters, let's talk about my final store, which is Forever 21. I'm moving through this pretty quickly. I have sushi downstairs, so I'm like trying to breeze through, you know what I mean? The first thing is this really cute dress, and it is one of those that has like the cutout shoulders. I love cutout shoulder. This is strange, but I love cutout shoulder in this design. I don't know, not this design, like this color, like the gray marl, do you know what I mean? I don't know why. I just think it looks so dope. Um, maybe it's like the texture of the marledness or something but it just has cut out shoulders and it's just a nice long skater dress perfect for this time of year when it's still a little bit chilly I thought that this would look amazing with pretty much everything um maybe not so much of a spring break piece as much as just like an essential in my closet then I found this hoodie and I think it's like supposed to be a hoodie dress I'll probably wind up wearing it over leggings it is this really cool just like slashed up af hoodie. Um, you can find these anywhere, Topshop, Forever 21, Urban, anywhere. Um, I just liked this one and it's it's basic AF, but so am I, so that's fine. I feel like I'm finally on the crushed velvet train and maybe it's like starting to take off. Like in a in the way where I don't think everyone's wearing it as much as they were over the holiday season, but I still like it. So I found these, oh, see, and it still freaks me out. Sometimes I touch it and it just, it gives me goosebumps, I don't know. This piece is a really pretty little, just like plain skater dress. It's that really beautiful mauve grayish lilac color. Super dope and I don't know, just really, really basic and plain. This is just from the Straight Size Collection, by the way. They carry an XL in a lot of those pieces, um, if you're ever curious. Then I grabbed this bad boy. This is just a bodysuit and it's like a high neck closes in the back like so. Um, it's just a choker top and I really, really like this a lot. Um, I liked the color on it. I liked the fit. I liked the everything pretty much. So I'm going to be wearing this and I think that this will be a good one to really dress up. Like tuck it into a skirt, dress it up. You know what I mean? How I want to try to wear that and I haven't decided if it's going to work is with this skirt. Now, Forever 21 has been re releasing this skirt in chunks on the plus size section of the website. This is a strange tangent, but hear me out. So they'll release it in like two colors, let it completely sell out, and then bring it back two weeks later in like more colors. So they had it in this pink. The pink sold out. They brought it back in like a camely color, then that sold out, and now it's out in like a black and a blue. And I don't know, I saw the pink back in stock the other day, so I have no clue, but I want to try to pair it with this skirt. Um, the reason I'm not sure is because it has like texture to it, like little bumpy detailing and I don't really know why that's the go-to for this because I almost think it's sort of weird but the skirt itself is cute so I guess we'll see maybe there's a reason it's like that who knows this is covered in my dog's hair because I've worn it so many times already I couldn't wait to film this haul this is just a varsity jacket I grabbed from the plus section it's in like this maroon color and it has gray sleeves I wore this over a Calvin Klein bra and just a little gray skirt I thought it was freaking adorable so 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 stinking cute and it fits so well it's really comfy I love varsity jackets like this that are like basically glorified cotton you know what I mean um this one still has like some nice leg lining to it but like varsity jackets like real varsity jackets feel like crap this feels great this feels like a hoodie you know what I mean I also got this made in the 90s t-shirt uh, a while ago actually but I have not worn it yet so it's really cute it's just like a white t-shirt with a made in the 90s and like maroon on it. I thought this would be really cute and I was, as a matter of fact, made in the 90s. I'm also obsessed with all things 90s. Just for the record, like absolutely all things 90s. Like give me all of it, 
all day, every day. Oh, I found this skirt. I thought this was really nice. It's just like a little gray pencil skirt and it um it's not super structured. It has like a lot of give and a lot of stretch, but I thought it would add like a more polished look to something while still not being super polished. It's not like I'm wearing a pencil skirt. I'm wearing something that resembles a pencil skirt. You feel me? So I just thought it was super freaking cute and like soft and comfy and that's that's what I live in. A really pretty like black base with um just pink floral on top and it has a crisscross design in the front which I love crisscross on everything I just think it adds like so much character and makes the outfit so much more fun and this also only has half sleeves so it'll be perfect for this time of year I just thought it was such a nice little dress um and I don't know actually I'm really looking at this and I really want to style it for fall too like I feel like this will be a good year-round dress you know okay so I totally forgot to mention these in the video and I could not complete this haul without them they are these really cool forever 21 jeans with little patches on them but they have like a little bit of distressing and distressing down the front and then like a little um, like rose patch and this hello and it's all so super cute and they fit so well. They're really comfy and I just think they're amazing. So I had to show them. I found these shoes and just really thought that I needed them and I kind of don't have a lot of basic shoes right now. Um, in the move, I just realized how many things I was clinging on to that I wasn't even wearing anymore. I got rid of so many of my nice shoes. Um, so I needed things just like basic black booties again, which I know seems like a staple, but I feel like the style of black booties changes constantly. These are more sock boots. So they're like really nice and fitted to the leg. And I think that that's a really cool and sexy look and they have a super duper high heel but it's thick so I don't feel like I'll be uncomfortable walking around in it I did grab them in black I also did grab them in this really beautiful camely color um, and it has like the darker wood heel on it and they feel really nice they feel like real suede I know that they're not um, so I just grabbed those and I think that they're amazing. I grabbed some chokers. I love chokers I love having them in all colors. I got this like kind of satiny one in this greenish hunter green shade it almost is like duochrome -y under my ring light I got this lilac -y one as well it's really beautiful and soft and pastel I got this one and it's like more of a dressy one it has rhinestones in the middle and it's so freaking pretty I got two glitter ones one is just a black glitter and the other one is a hot pink same thing just different same same but different <laughs> and then I got this um statement like chokery piece thing this would have looked really cute with what I'm wearing today I have missed a window of opportunity. It's just a really pretty like pastel-y gemstone choker and I thought it was so freaking cute. My camera's dying so I'm trying to hurry. Um, I grabbed two bags. I'm a sucker for like high-end bags too but honestly Forever 21 has killer bags and they're the best price. They're so nice. They last forever too. This one is like this gemstone clutch. It's such a beautiful color and I thought it would be so nice for going out. Does this not look like it came from like Nordstrom you know what I mean or like Saks or something. It looks so high-end and it was so inexpensive. It was like $30 so I thought it would be amazing for that. The other bag is so cute. The strap is like right here um so it's just a crossbody but then it has a little black pocket with it. I just thought that the colors were so cute. It would have been cute for fall too, but I'm going to get away with it in like this sort of, um, you know, end of February, beginning of March, like this sort of time period. I still think this is so cute. It's sort of like the anti-Valentine's bag. I'm here for it. Um, but I just think it's really nice and it feels amazing. Like it feels like the best made bag ever. And that is it for this haul. You guys, I'm going to go ahead and go. I feel like I've been filming for 10 freaking years. I hope you all enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you've not already. I love you all so, so, so much. Thank you for always supporting me and being part of my family. And I will catch you in the next video.